What are you up to, Finn? Finn's pumping energy into the new form, and making it unstable like my Venom did. Which exploded the bridge. So... what? Does she want to blow up the theater? <sighs> Not the theater. Rockstone Plaza. Whoa, what? That's... how could she... It's not open yet, so there'd be no casualties. But I can't let her do this. I'm taking a new form. Come on, come on! Crap, crap, crap! Spread out! He's here somewhere! I need to get the new form. After I deal with her glow stick army. Just to put it out there, what if Finn's right, and this is the best way to beat Roxxon? Finn's not just talking about throwing a rock through a window. She wants to blow up a building on my block. If any part of her plan goes wrong, people will get hurt. I can't let her take that chance. You're right. Let's get that new form out of here. <gasps> You're done.
words. How about you stop being so clingy? How is she not tired yet? It is not going well. Where are you? I don't know. I'm diving explosions. I need a new strategy. Gonna do what you said. Tell her the truth? Yeah. As soon as I catch her. 
Tinkerer, I gotta tell you something. Slow down. Do you think I'm stupid? You want to hear this? I promise. Step off. reason not to end you. My mom would be very upset. Maya? Can we just... Get you on the roof! my place i'm actually at home my parents get back next week so i thought i'd clean but i could come back nah it's okay i'll call you later now what hey uncle aaron i need um i need some advice about what exactly just everything are you free i can wrap up what i'm doing call you in a few Thanks, man. Talk to you soon. I have no idea where Finn is, or the new farm. Guess I should kill some time till Uncle Aaron's free. Howard? Oh, pigeon guy. Pete told me about him. Let's see what he needs. There's Howard. Hey, Howard. I'm the other Spider-Man. Pleasure to meet you. Thanks for the help. I've got three birds missing. Worried about them in this cold. I can track them. Do you have anything that, uh, belonged to them? Uh, feathers were? Perfect. Got it. I'll be back. Oh, hey, you've scanned one of Howard's pigeons. Howard Protocol now active. Howard Protocol? Welcome to Pigeon Facts, your source for daily fun facts about pigeons. Oh, no, no, no. Unsubscribe. You have opted in. A second coup? Someone steal Howard's birds? Pigeon trails go in three directions. Should check them all. <sighs> oh 
active crime scene. Looks like a break-in. Third break-in this week. Setting a new record at this rate. Hey, officers. What's the situation? Can I help? Tenants a bugle reporter. Place was tossed upside down, but nothing's been stolen. Whatever they're looking for wasn't here. Hmm. Let me look into it. Maybe I'll have more luck. Oh, gotta run. Swing, did you know? <laughs> These birds are fast. What do they eat? Coffee? Sugar? Jet fuel? Gotcha. Hey, Howard. Caught a bird. She's pretty feisty. Mm, I bet it's Piggy. <laughs> Lots of pimp. She can find her way back, Spider-Man. Just corner in my direction. Will do. All right. Should head back to the coop. Track the other birds. Over 200,000 carrier pigeons were used during... There! Hold still! Okay. Checking the note. Change of plans. We're moving now. Hmm. Hey, Howard. Whatever they're using your pigeons to plan, they want to go ASAP. They're looking for a fast communication system. I could think of easier ways. You've got that right. Gonna keep digging into this. I'll be in touch. One more. This got a lot more complicated than I expected. be the pigeon thieves talking through carrier pigeons i'll admit i didn't think it'd work but i'm a believer now well, i just thought cops are tapping our phones so why use phones i don't believe this genius we'll need more birds though sure sure after we're done here oh why we gotta be so damn cold all the time How'd you find us? You can't hack our cell phones. We're using birds to communicate. Who knew Spider-Man investigated aviary crime? One of them dropped something. Tomorrow night, roof, be there. The bugle? Hey, Pigeon! Stop! Pigeon Factory. Here we go. Not gonna lie. Kinda enjoying these. Peter Parker did not like pigeons. Until he met Howard. Sometimes, you don't realize how special something is until you see it through the eyes of a friend. Okay. Got him! Howard! You got all your birds. The bad news is, the gang is using them to plan a series of break-ins. Oh, no. Tell me you got some good news, too. Yep, I know where the gang's gonna be. The Bugle. Gonna take him out and keep your pigeons safe. Love it. Give him hell, Spider-Man. Time to save the Daily Bugle from a break-in. MJ will be proud. Man's all here. Pigeons did their work. One of our guys set the bugle off against a pigeon. I don't know which, but I will. In time, we break in, destroy the evidence, stop the story before it's done. Makes sense to me. Anything else in there we can steal? Journalists? Kind of mad at not doing the same way old computers and coffee What was that noise? Guess it was nothing.
nobody messes with my crew. What was that noise? Must be hearing things. Harder and harder for an honest criminal to make a buck in this town. Huh. Guess it was nothing. You hear that? Yo, guys! This web's a... My turn! It sucks to be you! I got feathers. Not sound as cool as I thought it would. There's a creativity award for crime planning. You guys win. Practicality? No, but definitely creativity. No, that's... stole your pigeons. They won't bother you anymore. Good looking out. Now I just gotta talk to my birds about picking better friends. <laughs> <laughs> well, if y'all need me again, just hit up the app. Good meeting you, Howard. You too, Spider-Man. Hey, nephew. Meet me at the docks in Hell's Kitchen. I'll be there. What am I gonna do about Finn? Try talking to her again? I could meet her somewhere. The Science Center or Trinity Church? No. She knows I lied to her now. She won't want to see me. <sighs> I mean... I mean, she might. Though it'd be incredibly awkward if uh, Miles' mom invited her over, you know, something like that. And just that playing pretend throughout dinner type of uh, dealio. Mr. Creek, you've been out promoting the benefits of your new form reactors, the first of which is set to open in Harlem. Yet, you've had some critics. Hmm. Well, first off, Jonah, uh, let me say what an honor and a pleasure it is to be on your show. Oh, well, I'm blushing. And, yeah, you're right, we've had some resistance. Most notably from Rio Morales, who uh, looks to be a new city council member in the upcoming special election. And I have a, I have a lot of respect for Ms. Morales. Uh, she's smart, she's a great role model for young women, but I think she's putting her energy in the wrong place. Our new form reactors will make this a better city, a better home for New Yorkers. But I... I I guess some people just have a hard time with change. Let me give you some advice. One highly successful man to another. You know what I like to say to my critics? <laughs> you and the horse you rode in on. <laughs> well, okay, I, I, uh, I admire your conviction. You're, uh, you're a man who's not afraid to pay a fine in order to make uh, your point. Fine? What do you mean? Jared, how much? <laughs> do your editing thing, quick! Get 
getting close to the docks. Hope Uncle Aaron's there. Leave me alone, Roxanne. 